My greatest extravagance is probably my unhealthy love of beer. Love beer. Charlie Day stopped by to talk to me. He is in the TV show, It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia, and currently in the film, Pacific Rim. Uh, all right, let's start talking about Pacific Rim. Huge movie, Guillermo del Toro, uh, monsters, as he said it himself, it's robot porn. Uh, how did you come to do this part? I came to the movie because Guillermo is a big fan of It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia, and I just got a random call and he asked me if I wanted to be a part of his film. And so it was a very easy decision. I actually hadn't even read a script, but I, I knew I wanted to work with Guillermo. And uh, that was that. The words or phrases I most overuse are, I say you know. It's like, um, I say you know like a nervous habit. Obviously, I can't imagine not enjoying anything with Guillermo. It was tough because uh, I just had a baby. It was also amazing and wonderful because Guillermo builds these elaborate worlds. Any set you went into, any shot you were a part of, there were always uh, hundreds of more elements other than just sort of the obvious. Does it feel like that on It's Always on Sunny in Philadelphia? That's a whole different thing because that that's my baby and, mm -hmm. and my pride and joy. and. Uh, Completely the opposite, you know, we have nine dollars to work mm -hmm. with um, and we say, you know, how are we going to stretch these nine bucks to make them seem like 25 bucks? Those environments feel real because we go into real crack houses or <laughs> right. whatever, whatever. Okay, my greatest fear is, come on, who knows, death? Um, living forever? Large dogs? I don't know. I'm afraid of everything. What advice do you have for, for people like yourself a decade ago? I think take it into your own hands. And even Guillermo, after uh, you know, a couple decades working as a filmmaker, someone has given him uh, that blank check to make whatever he wants. But starting out, you can make it. Mm -hmm. And you should make it. And uh, sometimes those limitations actually lead to better ideas. Uh, let's see. If I could change one thing about myself, it would be... Hmm, I probably would be taller. Probably be a little taller, just a little bit, you know, just a little bit. Not a lot taller, just a little taller. Until next time.